young person coming to the college, especially B Tech first year student from there after their 12th, they feel like that, that I'm going to enter into a campus where somebody will open the door and there is going to be ah, ah, ah. no. Study hard so that you can party really hard. Sir. हम तो स्टडी नहीं करते फिर भी पार्टी हार्ड कर लेते हैं तुमने म्यूजिक सिस्टम लगाया तुम पढ़ा लिखा ही नहीं करते तुम पार्टी शुरू किए उसमें म्यूजिक बज रहा था अभी तो पार्टी शुरू हुई तुम नाचना शुरू किए और नाचते नाचते तुम्हें याद आया चार बैग अब नाचो टेल मी हु आर योर फ्रेंड्स आई विल टेल यू वट इज योर फ्यूचर कंट्री इज नॉट रियली लुकिंग फॉर जॉब सीकर्स we are really looking forward for some job givers i always say lazy man has no time for anything and busy man has all time for everything aur mujhe to lagta hai ki 14 se 22 saal ka jo umar hai na isme to jitni matlab jitni struggle ho jaye utna gajab hoga agle 22 saal ke baad wale time mein pata hai apne hisse ki mehnat apne hisse ke struggle sabko karni hai कुछ लोग पढ़ाई करते वक्त कर लेते हैं कुछ लोग नौकरी ढूंढते वक्त और अपना चीज को भी अच्छा नहीं लगता है मैं डिटेल में नहीं जाऊंगा एंड फैकल्टी मेंबर्स फॉर गिविंग मी दिस प्लेटफॉर्म एंड अपॉर्चुनिटी टू इंटरेक्ट विथ माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स आई ऑलवेज लव टू इंटरेक्ट विथ ऑल ऑफ यू ऑन अ डिफरेंट प्लेटफॉर्म मेजोरिटी ऑफ टाइम इन द क्लास एंड समाइम इन द hostel as well uh already sir uh, cover all those points which actually i wanted to share with all of you but uh i'll try to you know uh rephrase those things in my own way in my own style and uh, i think that all of you are going to get something really i uh, know uh, great out of this particular orientation program uh i'm going to talk about three different things which is really very very important for first year students whether they are first year b tech student or first year mba or mc student or bba or b pharm or bc students this is a new beginning for all of you right the journey already began you have spent somewhere around 2 3 weeks maybe more than that in this campus and as dr sir rightly said all of you are really blessed really best that you are getting an opportunity to face different sort of challenges of residing in a hostel residing alone facing those challenges actually you are making yourself prepared for the real world which you are going to encounter after you know for beating students maybe after 4 years and for the rest of the students 2 years or 3 years you are getting really prepared for that and you must feel you know must be thankful to uh, the situation where you are getting this opportunity i understand that majority of you are facing a lot of problems especially in the starting few days few weeks so i'm going to talk about the importance of you know bonding of the people joining of the people one of one of my student in the first year asked me sir can you suggest some good you know uh, platforms a youtube channel from where i can learn different coding things and all i said i will share those things with you but before that i wanted to share one thing with all of you is start making friends in the first year in the hostel in your professional course you must learn the art of making friends majority of you may be feeling you know that this is a very funny statement but it's not i have one very important you know a quote from uh, some other person and this quote is very close to my heart and the quote is tell me who are your friends i will tell you what is your future and this is true this is true to all the senses this is true for you know personal life this is true for professional life and this is true for life actually we all are 
the product, the men and women are always the product of its environment. Its environment. And environments come from where? By making friends, forming groups, making team. Because ultimately, all of you are going to work in a team in the corporate world. So you must learn and must be wise with whom you are making friends. Because we are, human beings in general, are the average of six people with whom they are spending their time. So my dear friend, be wise, be smart while interacting with your friends, with your seniors, as Dr. Edison Director has already quoted. Be smart. Refrain from negative energy people. Because you'll find a lot of people who are always having you know, this creeping sense that everything is negative about this, this whole world. They start with the college, they start with the teachers, they start with the hostel, the food, the other, other things. They have problems with, with, with even their family, their parents, with the country. There are people who are having this negative approach. Do not interact with them. Refrain from them. That is advisable. Create some really great healthy environment. Because all of us are product of our environment. Now, great college. Great colleges like anyone, you know, any, any, any institute like IIT or IM or any NITs or for say, uh, you know, top class university of the world. The institute, the universities are not made of these infrastructures, the teachers, the dean, directors and even chairman. The institute used to be made because of the environment created by the students. So it's completely in your hand. What sort of environment you are going to create? Right? You are going to start your journey. Right? Forget about the past. Whatever happened, happened. You cannot go and correct it. The things have started. Now you have a lot of time. And let me tell you, the journey of thousand miles start with a single step. And some of you already taken those steps. This first year, if a student started to believe that I'm going to get, say, 50 lakh or say, one crore package, four years, enough time to work on those things. Right? And we often talk about the placement, we often talk about the, you know, uh, you know uh, the money and the package and other things. I wanted to take some point out of the director, sir, additional director, sir. And I wanted to mention one thing. We, this, 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 you know, this country is not really looking for job seekers. We are really looking forward for some job givers. Create a group, make a team, and work on entrepreneurship development, sir. Have a mindset of creating something really big. Come up with the ideas. Believe me, we are going to provide you the platform from where you can fetch some funding. We can invest in your ideas and be a successful entrepreneur. And these things used to start from the first year itself. And majority of these things start from hostel. Are you getting my point? You have you, you, both the things. You have enough time. You, at least you have two, two hours extra with you. In comparison with your day scholar friends. In those two hours, you have choice of spending time on gossiping, watching some reels, or doing some other activities. And at the same time, you have the opportunity to discuss on some business ideas, to discuss on some coding skills, discuss on different skills, which you really want to, you know, which is going to help you out. It's completely in your hand, right? It's your choice. And these things used to start from the first year itself. The best thing is that. No, it's, it's all about habit. Right? It's all about lifestyle. So you have to inculcate those things. Right? So be choosy with your friend circle. And one more thing is there. What I, what I, what I feel that you know, these students, uh, some of the students I already interacted in the first year of BTEC as well as in MC and MBA. 
they are not approachable. Majority of times they are just sitting idle, not interactive. Learn the art of getting interaction, getting indulging with the people. Be approachable, approach people. Right? And at the same time, let others approach you. That is something which is required. And that is in a very healthy manner. You can see, I, I, I often say that you cannot interact. Sometimes it is very difficult for you know, young people like you to interact with a uh, you know, person of opposite gender. Why? The reason is nothing. The reason is you don't have, you don't want to make a healthy relationship. That's the problem. I understand. Got it? So, you know, learn the art of you know, interacting with the people. Because majority of your problems are going to get sorted out by your friends only. Right? I have seen uh, students are learning in interpersonal skills. They don't know the, you know, the unreal understanding of you know, the importance of the soft skill and the interpersonal skills. I often take this example. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm going to take uh, this um, example. I already shared some of, in, with the, some of the students already. But I wanted to quote this. Uh, you are feeling thirsty and you wanted to, you know, drink water. You went to a shop, you asked the shopkeeper, please give me a bottle, or, you know, a bottle of water, a water bottle. He's going to offer you a bisleri bottle, which costs somewhere around 20 rupees. You are happy to give him 20 rupees and take that water, that, that water bottle, and we'll drink the water. On the next day, on the next day, once again you are feeling thirsty, you approach to the shop, you approach to the shopkeeper, you ask for the water, and now shopkeeper offered you the same bottle of this lady, packed bottle, but that bottle is not having this wrapper. Are you going to offer him, you know, give him 20 rupees? Majority of time, don't. <laughs> Depend on whether you are feeling too much thirsty or not. Right? Even if you are too much thirsty, still you will bargain with the shopkeeper. You will try to, you know, bargain and try to get it at 10 rupees or 5 rupees. All the water is same. The bottle is same. Why you are not going to pay this 20 bucks? Brand value. And I'm not going to talk about the brand value. I'm going to take another example. This water in this bottle is your hard skills, which you are going to inculcate in all these years. And this wrapper is the soft skill, the interpersonal skill. So sometimes we, we do not take this soft skill classes and soft skill things in a very, you know, in, you know, in, 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 in serious manner. Try to understand soft skill is incorporating, helping you out to sell your hard skills. People do have those hard skills, but because of lack of this interpersonal skill and soft skill, they are lagging behind. And let me tell you, I interact with your final year students, third year students in a mock interview and majority of them are lagging this communication, interpersonal skill, and soft skill part. You'll wonder that nowadays, companies are not only looking for the IQs, they are looking forward for the EQs, the emotional quotient of the students. And how this emotional quotient developed? That used to develop in the hostels. Believe me, this, you, these, these, these things are going to use, you know, develop in the hostels. It's completely up to you whether you are going and interacting and taking those challenges, interacting with your fellow friends, your seniors, right? That is something which is required. So I wanted to talk about that friendship angle, the, you know, uh, making connects. So rightly said, you know, in your final year or in your third year, when you are going for a higher package job, you will ask from your seniors about the referrals. I think all of you are aware of this referral thing. Yes or no? Referral? Yeah, you might be knowing about that thing. And now in your third year, we are approaching your senior for referral. Do you think that your seniors are going to help you out? No. 
No. Why? Because you haven't made a connection with them. You can you can make a connection with your seniors, all these great, great successful students from 2022 batch, 2023 batch, and then 20, 2024 batch. Have a relationship, make connections with them, and do not interact with them for just just for some work. Just connect up with them for any for any means. I wanted to connect with you. He may ask, she may ask. What help you want? help me I just wanted to get connected with you. That's it. Build those relationships from the first year. So that in your third year, you are not even going to ask him or her about the referrals. They eventually give you the referrals. Which will help you in getting a job. My dear friends, people often ask me, what is the mantra of success? And let me tell you, from my experience, what I came to know, there are two things required to get success. The first one is, be the best in your field. Be the best in your field. And majority of us are not best in our field. So what is the second thing? The connect effect. Whether you are going to go for a higher job, High package of whether you are going for a, you know, higher studies, whether you are going to start your own venture and a business, you need to connect with people. If you understand the beauty of making connections with the right people, with the right attitude people, successful people, you will learn the art of getting successful. Now, if time is going to permit, I want you to talk about another thing which majority of you are lagging, and that is time management. Time management. You are new to the institute. You have classes from 9 till 5, then some extra classes. Most majority of you are not getting time for self-studies. Yes or no? Yes, sir. Majority of you are coping of problem with, you know, residing away from your mama, papa. Right? First time coming here. A lot of emotional, you know, things are happening with you. Sometimes you are not able to express anyone. Right? You are in your own zone. Not having anyone to, with whom you can share your feelings. I understand these problems. Majority of us understand these problems. See, and in that whole process, you are not finding time for yourself. Right. See, first of all, try to understand the importance of time. I always quote this thing. Those who don't respect time, time in the, you know, the vice versa, time doesn't support them, respect them. And time is something which is really very, very important. And you may understand one day, do not waste your time. First of all, understand the, the importance of time. Let us assume all of you have a bank account, right? Saving bank account. So just assume that somebody is putting 86,400 rupees in your account every day at 9 a.m. in your bank account. And there is a condition that you have only 24 hours till tomorrow 9 a.m. You have to spend those 86,400 rupees. What do you think? Are you not going to invest those 86,500? There's a single penny of that. The condition is tomorrow, after 24 hours, those 86,400 rupees are going to vanish. You will invest those money. You will spend those money in a most peculiar way. My dear friend, there is a bank which is not providing you 86,400 rupees, but 86,400 seconds, 24 into 16 to 16. And that is time. Are you giving importance to those 86,400 seconds? Ask yourself. Now, that is importance of time. That is importance of time. 
Now, how to manage time? Although I used to take this, you know, two hour session on how to manage your time, but quickly I just summarize it for all of you. Is, you know, time management is nothing, but prioritizing things in your life. Every single time, if me and other teachers are coming here and telling you study, study, and study, it's not possible. You cannot study for 24 hours. For, for your knowledge, if you are able to study for two or four hours every day, you can crack the most difficult examination in the, on this planet, that is civil services. But condition is daily. So you need not, you are not supposed to manage 24 hours of life. No one can. Not me. Not sir. No one. You have to maintain those two hours and four hours of your life. And for that sake, you have to prioritize things in your life. Making priority list. I always say, lazy man has no time for anything and busy man has all time for everything. I don't know whether you know me or not, but majority of you might have seen me in the hostel. Nine to five, you used to take class. You used to sit in the class. I used to take class. I love to, you know, be there in the classroom. And after 5 p.m., I take a quick break, go for a tea break. And I think majority of you have seen me, especially boys. I used to carry my racket and go to the badminton court. And from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. I was staying there. I used to be the first one to go there in the you know, court. I don't go to the first year court. I used to play with your seniors. They are very good badminton players. And then after that, I'm going to back to my home, bye bye to my room. Then having my dinner. And I used to spend one and a, one and a half hour with my kid who is not residing with me. So here it comes another thing. If a person like me who is having, you know, uh, doing so much sacrifice. So one thing which you must learn for getting success, you need to sacrifice. You need to hustle. You need to struggle. And I think that the age of 14-22 struggle ho jaye, utna gajab hoga agle saal ke baad wale time. Believe me, I'm, I'm telling you from my heart, from my own experience. If you are struggling, if you are facing challenges in your life, be thankful <laughs> that at this age you are facing those challenges. But I have a say, I have to 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 do it now or do it after four years. Yes or no? Sir, prioritizing things in your life, if time is going to permit me, I'll have to permit it. Okay, thank you, sir. So, prioritizing things. Majority of you have, you know, uh, heard this story of a professor bringing that jar. Once again, I'm going to, you know, rephrase for all of you. There was a professor, a smart professor, who used to tease the students in, with the activities. So he bring a one jar, right, a glass jar to the, to the classroom. And he asked the students, this glass is, this jar is, you know, free, you know, it's, it's, it's empty. Try to fill this empty jar with certain things. Students are confused. They don't know what to, what to do with the jar, empty jar. Then one smart kid came out of the classroom and there were some stones, pebbles, small stones kept there in the, in the classroom. He filled that jar to the optimum level with that pebbles. The professor was happy. He said, great, great job done. But there's still some space vacant in the jar. Kindly fill this up. Then one another smart student come out from the class and he bring the sand and try to fill that jar with those sand. One second professor was happy, said, great job done, but still some space is vacant in the jar. Then a smart girl sitting on the first bench, she came up, she take the professor's water bottle and pour the water in the jar. Now the jar is full. 
Professor said, okay, everyone put your hands together. That's it. Oh, no, 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 no. The story is not ending here. Actually, the story is getting scattered from here. That professor was very smart. He said, one of the student, go and bring another jar of same capacity, having same volume, and telling the student, give me the same result, but change the sequence of things in this activity. Do you think the same result will be possible by changing the sequence? Never. If you are going to pour the water first, you cannot put the pebbles, because the moment you put pebbles, the water will you know, come out of the jar. If you are going to put the sand first, you cannot get the maximum, optimum result of the pebbles. Life is like that only. Prioritizing, prioritizing things in the life. Thing, making things in a very sequential manner. I don't know whether I should quote this thing or not, but majority of time, you don't follow the sequence. You don't follow the sequence. Especially when you are joining the institute in the first year. You always try to jump to the conclusion straight away. Everything great about this young generation, except one thing, and that is lack of patience. That is the problem. You always try to achieve things quick and fast. It never happened. I don't want to quote this, especially on this platform. In the classroom, I will quote another example, which you would like. So I'm refraining from quoting that example, but I, have, I hope that you understand that. Do not jump to the conclusion straight away. Take a baby step, step by step, right? And don't, don't, never be scared of taking those steps. Maybe some of you are new to new those things. Let me tell you, we all are new to one thing or the other at one point of time. I used to play badminton and believe me, I'm going to defeat any one of you. Sorry. <laughs> Maybe. I cannot be, you know, <laughs> too much of, uh, uh, what do you say, uh, overconfidence. But probably I'm going to, you know, beat you in the play of badminton. And believe me, four years just from today itself, I was unable to make a contact with the, you know, the, 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 cock and the racket, the settle and the racket. People learn these things from scratch. In four years time, from this podium to this young generation, who is half of my age, I'm challenging that I'm going to beat you in the badminton game. And four years back, I was unable to even touch the settle with the badminton racket. People, it happens. You start the coding, maybe you are not very comfortable with the coding concept. Start. Take an interest. Start with that dream and have patience. Give yourself some time. And believe me, you are going to learn that. Prioritize things in your life. One more thing. Whenever you achieve something, there are, there, there are problems with, with, with human being. We try, try to set a target, some bigger target. We are unable to achieve those targets and then we curse ourselves. Majority of you are doing that thing every day. Please reward yourself. Try to set some small, small targets, achieve those targets and don't forget to reward yourself. Are you getting my point? Put that on your back. And say, yes, I achieved something. I'll go for reward. I've been to engineering college. I've been to MBA college. One of the finest B school of the country. IIFT. I studied there in 2008. I took admission in 2008. I passed out in 2010. And there used to be a slogan in my college at IIFT. Study hard, party harder. 
पार्टी हार्डर पार्टी हार्डर आई हैव टेकन दिस स्लोगन टू माई लाइफ आई सेट राधेश्याम वर्क हार्ड एंड पार्टी हार्डर I wanted to give it to you all of you. Study hard so that you can party really hard. You deserve to get those, give yourself that those rewards. Are you getting my point? When I when 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 I quote this particular statement, some of the students are coming with a smile and say, "Sir, हम तो study नहीं करते फिर भी party hard कर लेते हैं." No, 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 you can't. पांच मैं उनको फिर याद दिलाता हूं अच्छा चलो तुम हो बेसरम राइट तुमने म्यूजिक सिस्टम लगाया तुम पढ़ाई लिखाई नहीं करते तुम पार्टी शुरू किए उसमें म्यूजिक बज रहा था अभी तो पार्टी शुरू है तुम नाचना शुरू किए और नाचते नाचते तुम्हें याद आया चार बैग अब नाचो नहीं नाचा जाएगा ऐसा नो so my dear friend until this you are not going to study hard you cannot party harder right you know in psit you might have seen that there are a lot of discipline let me tell you that you know the importance of you know uh, attendance and all and one more thing let me tell you i am trying to tell you from the my own experience i have been to several institute majority of them are from delhi and cr dehradun and punjab region and The X factor of PSI is nothing but the discipline. Everyone, please put your hands together for the discipline of this institute. <laughs> this is the X factor. X factor. Because success without discipline is an accident. Probably you don't understand this thing. I have seen campuses where lack of discipline is creating such a huge problem. Majority of time, people are not having classes running. Police used to visit the campuses. First year is having a fight with the second year. Second year is having a fight with third year. Hostlers. Probably you are kid. You may not understand these things, but try to understand. Just imagine. These discipline things are really counting a lot. You know, I talk about that. you know i i i talk about the patience let me talk about the perseverance consistency all of you the btech students they might have prepared for cat into iit je examination maybe you know somewhere down the line maybe because of two numbers or three number or five number you might not sitting there at iit not an issue not an issue they may have a bigger platform to launch themselves we also do have a great platform you cannot say this thing that we are not having platform your seniors already proved that thing with the flying colors student of psit are getting placed in 40 lakh 50 lakh packages and at your time it is going to be 1 crore package this is this is something which i really looking for now and whenever we talk about these big things you people are getting excited but this is just a brighter part there are some darker side to it and my dear friend lot of struggles are be going to be there one of your senior girls or still girls student must be knowing i wanted to quote her name ankita is there she is from ec background ec branch your senior your final year student I taught her, and believe me, I haven't found someone who is so hardworking in three years of engineering from EC background. And let me tell you, EC is not easy. Electronics, communication, engineering itself is very tough. She started doing coding, and in three years, in three years, she solved more than three thousand, four thousand problems from different platform. A lot of sacrifices used to happen. for getting those results we often talk about those results we don't talk about those hustles those struggles those sacrifices you have to learn the art of sacrificing you need to learn without sacrifice no one ever achieve anything in their life 
So this is about time management, prioritizing things in your life. Last thing, which is, which is very close to my heart, a sense of belongingness. May I ask, whose college is this? Whose college is this? Is this a college of directors, sir? Additional director, sir. My, my, is this my college? Is this for, for a sec, is this a college of our chairman, sir? No. No. This is your college. You are the alumni of this college. You have to form that bond with this institute. Believe me. मैं आपको अपने एक्सपीरियंस से बताता हूं मैं अपने बीटेक कॉलेज या बीएमबीए कॉलेज के आसपास से गुजरता हूं ना अपने आप गाड़ी रुक जाती है और मैं जाके अंदर नहीं जाऊं तो मैं गेट को छू के ऐसे ऐसे करके आ जाता हूं क्योंकि जीवन में जो पाया उन्हीं से पाया आफ्टर टेन ईयर वेन यू विल कम फ्रॉम कैलिफोर्निया लेट एस टॉप बिग If we will not think big, we will not talk big. We how could we are, we are going to achieve big? Yes or no? And you came from your workplace to meet with your family and friend, and you are going by this road. Believe me, after ten years, even after ten years, your car will stop at the gate. Probably you are not going to enter in this campus, but you will feel that thing. You feel nostalgic. You feel that this is the college from where I got all those things. sense of belongingness <laughs> develop this hang hang it i am janta hu i know <laughs> many of you could decide many of your seniors maybe you have you you, you you young person coming to the college especially btech first year student from there after their 12th they feel like that i am going to enter into a campus where somebody will open the door and there is going to be ah no it never happened it never happened this is the real world my dear friend this is the real world college used to be like this only okay you make it decide you make it decide you make trip about the institute about the teachers about the facilities about the food about n number of things अच्छा एक बात बताओ आप किसी साइज किसको करते हो सिर्फ अपने चीजों को सिंस यू टूक एडमिशन इन दिस कॉलेज दिस इज योर ओन कॉलेज दैट्स वाई योर क्रिटिसाइज है आप दूसरे कॉलेज को थोड़ी करते हो और अपना चीज को भी अच्छा नहीं लगता है मैं डिटेल में नहीं जाऊंगा सो एट द एंड ऑफ दिस इज योर राइट जस्ट एक्सेप्ट इट इम्प्रेस इट this college is going already started giving you a lot of thing all those facilities sir already talk about that if you wanted to get a job there are some extra classes you need batches if you wanted to play sports sports very close to my heart play sports if you wanted to participate in extra curricular activities there are clubs come up with your own ideas suggestions you are the stakeholder sir will listen to you right there is a, but there is a timing after 5 meet with sir log because man you know 9 to 5 they are very busy in different activities right after 5 meet with him and he will definitely listen to you your problems your suggestions and other things got it if you wanted to go for act if you wanted to go for higher studies it's not necessary that everyone is going to be a coder no you wanted to get entry to iia what if you senior From mechanical, he got ninety nine point five percent out of this campus. Please put your hands together for that, your senior ninety nine point five percent out of that. From BSI, these things are changing. Things are changing, and your seniors are already made it. And all of you are going to provide those things because it is you who is going to make this college a really great college. Work in that direction. Work in that direction. Have a sense of belongingness. Don't be creep. Never ever cry about the things which is not happening in your life. I'm going to conclude this. 
गाइस आपको क्यों नहीं रोना है कि आपके पास ये नहीं है वो नहीं है ये फैसिलिटी नहीं है वो फैसिलिटी नहीं है एक सेंस ऑफ ना एटीट्यूड ऑफ ग्रेटिट्यूड डेवलप करो हु इज बिग इन दिस वर्ल्ड बी फॉर बिग आई फॉर इन जी फॉर ग्रेटिट्यूड यू नीड टू हैव थैंकफुलनेस एंड ग्रेटिट्यूड towards whom towards the god towards your family towards the teachers towards the hostel or oh no warden towards all the people around you kyunki aapke paas shoes nahi hain iske liye aap tab tak ro sakte ho jab tak ki aap kisi aise se na milo jiske paas paon hi nahi hain so be happy with the things which you have you are having and I don't know whether we are going to meet at this level or not, but my dear friend, I want all of you to come up with this flying colors, and believe me, that one crore journey is going to start from the first year itself. Thank you, thanks for your presentation, Mr. Vijay. Thank you so much for such wonderful words of wisdom. Indeed, interpersonal skills, time management, and smart goal setting are some of the